Modern technologies like artificial intelligence, machine learning, data science and big data are all the buzzwords that everybody has been talking about but no one really understands. Some people also say that they are all the same just like South Indians. Not only they are completely wrong but they are also techist. That's why we thought why not explain these concepts in the simplest way possible. In this video, I am going to explain the difference between all these technologies and how they are being used in businesses. Plus, I am also going to shower you with lots of examples so be ready for some exciting tech. Hi, I am Tanya and welcome to Inside AMS. But before we begin, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe button and make the AI community stronger. The terms data science, artificial intelligence and machine learning fall in the same domain and are connected to each other. There may be overlaps in these domains every now and then, but essentially each of these three terms has its unique uses of its own. For example, shades of pink. There is prussia pink, taffy pink, rouge pink, hot pink and 28 other shades, but they all fall under the color pink. Similarly, machine learning, data science, big data, deep learning, neural networks, natural language processing and many other similar terms fall under the umbrella of artificial intelligence. Artificial intelligence is a wide term with applications ranging from robotics to text analysis. In its simplest term, AI is the ability to give computers the ability to replicate human intelligence. By creating computers that are capable of learning, it's possible to teach them from experience. Such artificial intelligence systems have three qualities: intentionality, intelligence and adaptability. These qualities give them the ability to make decisions that essentially require human level of expertise and experience. For example, self-driving cars and facial recognition system. In today's world, cars like Tesla knows another car and a truck. Similarly, iPhones can recognize your face even with a meter beard. We have explained AI in detail in another video. The link is up here. On the other hand, machine learning is the subset of AI that focuses on narrow range of activities. It is in fact the only real artificial intelligence with applications in real world problems. Much of the focus of machine learning is to create programs and software that can learn to make predictions and decisions without being directly programmed to do so. The technology can be used for all kind of purposes from powering search engines to diagnosing medical conditions. My favorite example would be Google Photos. Google Photos because it automatically stacks photos and create amazing memory videos. Other examples include targeted emails, ranking posts on social media, suggestions on Netflix and Amazon, suggestions on Instagram, LinkedIn, Facebook and the list goes on and on. Now moving on to data science. Data science is not exactly a subset of machine learning, but it uses machine learning to analyze data and make predictions about the future. Not the future where the world is going to end, but rather on a smaller level such as weather forecasts. Data science combines machine learning with other disciplines like big data analytics and cloud computing. Data science is the science of analyzing data sets to find trends, answer questions and draw conclusions. One of the coolest applications of data science and analytics is your smartwatch. It tracks your calories, sleeping cycles, heart rate and based on the data give you recommendations. Some more examples of data science are demand predictions, economic forecasts, credit scoring, advertising recommendations, etc etc. At Inside AML, we do not believe in knowledge barriers. So here is one more essential point you need to keep in your mind. Deep learning. As the layers of machine learning algorithms build up, they form complex networks that mimic the structure of the human brain. These artificial neural networks can learn to make intelligent decisions without additional human input. You will often find that the most human-like artificial intelligence systems are often powered by deep learning. 
This is because they are process unstructured data, data without clear labels. In simple words, you can also see deep learning as the advanced level of machine learning. Some of the common examples of deep learning are language recognition and sentiment analysis. Now, after listening to all these jargons, you must be thinking ki behen isko karte kaise so, isko karne ke liye, you need to know coding and computer languages. Python is one of the most common languages used in AI. We regularly come up with videos like these to keep you up with AI updates and trends. We are trying to build a strong AI community in India. And if you wish to be at the forefront, visit Inside AIML. It is India's most advanced AI learners community. I'll see you next time. Bye.